Hey guys, heading to the Toronto Film Festival. My husband has a movie premiering there. So come with me as I get ready and give you a little sneak peek as I get ready for the red carpet. Okay, so because I'm doing full hair and makeup, I'm gonna do my whole moisturizing mask situation. So the first thing I do is these are these little eye pads that I put under my eye as a mom with two young kids. Anything that makes me look not tired, I'm all about. So this helps a lot. So any kind of under eye thing that you guys like. And then what I'm gonna do is, oh, the fancy toilet's talking to me. Where's just wash the toilet? What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put this mask over that, make sure it's totally in the nooks and crannies. What I do is I cut the corner here so I can actually lift it up because you don't want all this wet stuff on the mask to touch your lashes because then if they're not dry enough, they won't curl and your lashes that we're gonna put on, if your lashes are still moist from the mask, it's a big mess and they won't stick. We want moisture in our skin, but not in our hair or our lashes or anything. We're gonna fold down the little edges of the mask so that it's not touching our hair. You just wanna rub in all the extra goodies that it left on your skin. So now we're having a little bit of lunch. A lot of times when you're doing an event like this, you don't eat for probably like eight hours. So we're having a little nibble and then we're gonna finish getting ready. Even when my hair is all wolfied out like this, the straightening iron is your friend. Okay. <clears throat> wow, a lot of stuff here just turns on automatically. It's kind of weird. So now I'm going to do my makeup and I'm running late. <laughs> so I'm gonna start rushing here, but let's do it. Start with clean hands. I'm gonna wash my hands right now. So a lot of the stuff I'm about to do well, for my makeup is stuff that I've already done tutorials and shown you guys. Um, so I'm pretty much gonna do some really similar basic things I normally do. But today we're gonna add some lashes because when you're on a red carpet and there's flash bulbs and things like that and the lights, you totally kind of wash out. So we have to kind of pump up the volume a little bit. Let's do it. Okay, so for the concealer, just cover any little problem areas you have. Next, I'm moving on to my foundation. So I use a little sponge that I can wet and then just get it all in there and then just dab it. You always want to make sure that it goes down onto your neck because it's terrible when you see the line there. No good. A lot of times I like using a translucent powder, like this one. But today I'm actually gonna, again, because I'm, I'm gonna be having pictures taken and you can get pretty washed out, I'm gonna use um, more color. Contour, a great friend. You wanna find your natural cheekbone line, get a little bit of a darker color. And just do the line and then blend it in. And then we do it on the side of your nose, that's a little trick. And then you line. Okay, so then on top of the cream, I do a, a contour powder. Follow that same line and brush it up. And on the sides of the nose, fill a line. And then I do a little on the sides. Okay. So just line it up. Okay, so got my dress on that my kids picked out for me, first one they chose. Got my boots. <laughs> and I got my champagne. Cheers.
Hope you guys like this video. Thanks for hanging out with me. Make sure to subscribe to my channel and turn on notifications so you know when I put up a new video and I will see you guys next time.